This movie is about updating Aureola. I've just made a new Conky which is named Aureola Phantom and we can see that we have here an Aureola skeleton active. So this is an, uh, a, a movie to show you guys if you have already Aureola installed you will find a hidden folder inside of your home directory and all you have to do every time you see me changing and adding elements to the Aureola Conky collection then you go to this little button here and you say get Aureola from GitHub to local drive and that's all you need to do. So you double click this or you go via terminal and you run it. It's going to get the latest version from uh, GitHub. It's going to put it first in the TMP file, temporary uh, directory. If things go slow you just uh, stop the program again and double click it again. Sometimes GitHub is a little bit uh, sluggish. Sluggish is the word. And then he says, uh, do you want to install everything in Aureola? So remember, it's going to be overwritten. So if you changed anything there, you shouldn't do that. You say yes, I'll write everything. And now we have this new version and uh, Phantom is added. And let's start this one. Like always, you start with the install Conky and you better open this one in terminal. Since there is a message, there is a communication. Install Conky. It's going to stop everything. He wants to know can I delete everything in this config Conky directory. If you change something and you didn't put it somewhere else, don't do it. Otherwise you say yes. There are new fonts. Uh, if the fonts are not installed, he's going to tell you that. And you say yes, install the fonts. And the fonts will be now added to the system and there you go the end and let's have a look how this new conky looks so this is one of the conkies of Jesse Avalos I've just uh, changed a little bit of uh, codes and, and, and elements uh, but uh, mainly he's uh, to credit to credit for that and uh, this is how you update every time you see something new from Aureola and uh, the only thing you have to do is to run a script and then uh, install the script you want. Okay, have fun using Ariola.